Um, I want to talk to everyone who's just tuning in, maybe right now at the top of the hour. Uh, we have a, a schedule coming up, so we're, we're allocating roughly 30 minutes per guest, and we're expecting our first candidate on at the top of the hour. So we've got about uh, seven minutes, five minutes or so, where we want to have some more conversation with uh, Scott Lagenauer, who is part of our coordinated campaign committee. Uh, and the coordinated campaign committee, I guess, is exactly what it sounds like. But rather than me explaining that, I'm going to turn it over to Scott so Scott can uh, tell you all about what CCC does and, and how they might be able to help you if you're running a campaign as well. Great. Thank you, Margaret. Hello, Cam. Hi, Mike. Hi, everybody uh, tuned in today. Um, I'm Scott Loggenauer. I am uh, co-chair of the Coordinated Campaign Committee, as Margaret just said. Um, I do have a bit of campaign and candidate experience I'll share, uh, most of which hails from uh, Western Massachusetts. Between oh, 2008 and 2015, I was pretty active. I was appointed to local commissions uh, by our local government. I ran for local government several times, as well as state representative, and very proud of that effort. So I kind of know what it feels like to serve in appointed positions and run for elected positions. Uh, the committee that I uh, co-chair, we're uh, 10 people, and we're elected by the National Committee of the Green Party of the U.S. to uh, work with Mike and the database administrator to track candidates, uh, as well as to support them. Uh, at every level, local, state, uh, Congress, except presidential. Um, we um, Two ways we primarily support our candidates is one through funding. Uh, we have a budget to give uh, grants to candidates. And this year we've uh, granted over $5,000 to candidates. And we're still, we have a few candidates for 2024 that we're uh, now considering funding. So as a uh, as the National Committee uh, approves a budget for us to support candidates with, uh, we use that money to support candidates. Uh, we also are in the process right now of developing a network a little bit more uh, with more rigor than the past. In the past, we just relied on um, individual email communication, but we now have a platform uh, that we're calling the candidate community that's now uh, consist of over 175 um, candidates and people who support candidates where we can uh, network on a more modern communication platform that makes it easier to network, it makes it easier to organize, it makes it easier to train, and we're just launching that at the moment. So if you are out there and you are, we're, and we're focused on 2024 already, we are planning our call for 2024 candidacies. So if you, any of you out there who are here to support our 2023 candidates tonight are thinking about running for office next year, please, please, please uh, contact the CCC and see how you can be a part of the growing and increasingly robust uh, candidate community that we support at all levels. I'm happy to be here, happy to see the rest of the program. Thanks everybody for putting this together. Could you just tell us how we would contact the CCC? Oh. CCC at gp.org would be the easiest way. 